The functionality should now be checked online because often errors are only discovered during runtime. First, the S7 SCL block is loaded into the automation system. S7 SCL gives you two options for checking the functionality program status and single step mode to monitor variable assignment step by step. To monitor the program status, you simply click on the Spectacles icon. In this way, variable assignments that occur during the block run can be observed online on the CPU. This is useful above all in finite state machines where statuses last for several cycles. With this function, however, you can't see very much because the changes happen so quickly. In the case of highly dynamic processes, like the one we have here, it is best to use the single step mode with breakpoints. In just a couple of clicks, the controller will interrupt the cyclical operation at the breakpoints. By going through the code step by step, you can have the contents of each variable on the CPU displayed. The error search is simplified considerably in this way, making it possible to do simple module tests beforehand with S7 PLC SIM, for example. This reduces even more the risk of having to change the code on the plant and can thus shorten the commissioning phase enormously. In conclusion, you can see that the sum of the options put at your disposal by S7SCL enables you to minimize costs considerably.